So can you tell us about the basics of the case? Yes, so on behalf of our client, Lock the Gate Alliance, uh, we're asking the tribunal to give us access to documents held by the New South Wales government about the exploration licence for the Shenhua Watermark coal mine in the Liverpool Plains. And in particular, the deal done behind closed doors between the government and Shenhua to buy back part of that exploration licence for $262 million. When did that buyback happen? Uh, that occurred in mid-2017. And can you tell us why this case is in the public interest? So this case is really important because it's seeking access to government documents which have been withheld from the public, which our client says will explain why the New South Wales government decided to pay Shenhua $262 million for um, its exploration licence. And the mine itself is located in a really important part of New South Wales, which is the Liverpool Plains. That is an area that has highly fertile agricultural soil and is really important for production of food in New South Wales. And how long have Lock the Gate been trying to get these documents for? Um, so they put in applications to the Department of Planning and Environment and the Department of Premier and Cabinet back in uh, late 2017. Um, those documents were, were refused on various grounds, including that they contained cabinet information and uh, Lock the Gates had to go to the tribunal to try to get access to those documents, uh, which it believes are very much in the public interest and should be released. So there will be a hearing tomorrow. That's right. So the hearing will start tomorrow morning in the New South Wales Civil and Administrative Tribunal and should continue all day. And our clients, Barrister, will be making submissions as to why it's in the public interest to release this information. And is the hearing under a freedom of information law? It is. So the hearing is in relation to our freedom of information laws in New South Wales. And that is the basis on which our client says that the public's entitled to this information, that it's government information that should be released so that the community can understand about decisions that have been made on big mining projects that affect everyone.